Hello. Today we are on week five, day five. We've been thinking about um, the strategy called asking questions. We will be reading a well-known folk tale from Japan that has some unusual happenings. The instructions say, ask yourself what is real and what is fantasy. Think about questions about the passage and write your question down below as we read. Long ago and far away, there lived an old man and woman. One day, the woman was washing clothes in the river. A big peach floated to her. She took the peach home to eat. When the woman began to open the peach, out jumped a little boy. The man and woman named him Momotaro, or Peach Boy. He grew up strong and brave. Life was wonderful until some ogres moved onto the nearby island. The ogres were stealing from people. Momotaro wanted to make, him make them go away. So Momotaro packed some of his mother's tasty dumplings. Along the way, he met a dog, a monkey, and a bird. Momotaro gave them each a dumpling. Each one said, I'll help you get rid of the ogres. With the help of his three friends, Momotaro made the ogres go away. Momotaro and his friends returned home with the ogre's treasure. Everyone in town cheered and called him a hero. Which one is the best title for the passage? A, the long river, B, the sweet fruit, C, a special sun, D, the helpful animals. Number two, which of these is real? A, animals that talk, B, a woman who washes clothes, C, a boy who comes out of a peach, or D, ogres on an island. Number three, how is Momotaro different from a real person? Momotaro can eat dumplings. Momotaro came from a peach. Momotaro is brave. Momotaro has animal friends. Number four, the author most likely wrote the passage to tell a, how helpful animals are, B, how to get rid of ogres, C, how a peach can be a boy, D, an interesting make-believe tale.